we're going to be doing some baking. So, I, once again, have bananas that were going over. They're way too ripe, and now the kids won't eat it. So I was thinking, why don't we make like a bun cake? So I got this. Last week we did muffins, and I went around the cabinets to see what I had. So I had some pecans left over. I pulled out of the freezer, remember that crumble we made with the apple crisps? So we're gonna use the crumble on the top. I'm gonna make like a cream cheese uh, glaze to go on top when it comes out. And we're gonna mix the pan. So in here I have flour, uh, baking powder, um, a little bit of salt, and I'm gonna mush the bananas. So I just peel the bananas and back of the fork, like this. I'm gonna get a mushy. And we're gonna make a batter. Do better on my sister. We're gonna really good at this last week. So bananas are mushed. We're gonna use two eggs. I'll post the recipe for it. Once again, okay, everything's in the bowl. Add the bananas. Yeah, the vanilla, the cinnamon, all our dry. I know some people do all the dry in the wet, they marry it, I don't know. I just wasn't in the mood right now to follow instructions, I guess. So I'm just mixing it all together. I also am not using a whisk, I'm using, it's kind of a really thick batter. Uh, we're winging it again, so it, you know, remember my other banana protein chocolate peanut butter, which I thought was an epic fail, but it actually tasted good. My friend David came over and ate the whole entire cake, actually. Taking our bun cake, I'm going to spray it once again. Spray the inside ring, don't forget that. I'm going to layer this into here now. Let's see? Evenly around. Uh, this is going to rise. So it looks kind of empty in the pan right now, but. All right, I'm making the glaze. I did a cream cheese with powdered sugar and a little bit of water, that's it. The cake came out, the strudel topping, like the whole thing, it worked out. Let's make sure, let's, it looks beautiful. Let's see if it tastes as good as it looks. Um, but now we have a really nice glaze that we're just gonna drizzle on top and I got my cake stand ready to go. Just so it's not slippery, I'm taking the pan out, resting it on here. I'm gonna lift it and put it right on our cake pan. Actually, you know what, let me get a spatula. I just lifted it and put it onto our cake stand, but just so you see, I made our life so much easier by wrapping in this in aluminum foil first. Um, I just used a spatula and a little set. This is gonna get washed and this is going in the garbage. Easy clean up! Got the cake, we got our glaze. Now, I watched something on the Food Network one time where they went like this, they drizzle. It's kind of working. It's kind of working. Yeah, I'm gonna do a spoon. Actually, actually we're gonna pour because my little spout. Back and forth, and there's our glaze on our cake. Actually, I'm gonna save a little bit on the side, so we cut the cake, we can like dip in, and I can have a little extra, but it's good stuff. 